Boop, boop. Yes. He's biting the tongs. Uh, wrong spot there, Night Gary. He's biting the tongs and he's wrapping the tongs. Well, this is the first. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna just set everything in here. And I know he's not gonna eat the tongs. Maybe. Maybe these tongs were a bad idea. I mean, that could be your hand right now. You know, you're very right. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the vlog. If you remember correctly, yesterday, hey. our buddy Jeff from Pondering Waters was over here at Legacy cleaning out the koi pond. And guys, look at how incredible the koi pond looks. And the fishies look so happy. Hi, fishies. And here pretty soon, when it starts warming up a little bit more and, and the koi fish metabolism starts kicking in, we can start feeding these guys and get them nice and big for the opening of the Legacy. But in the meantime, we're feeding the entire reptile zoo. Starting with butterscotch. Oh, wait a minute, Hold safety on. first. Right there. So basically we have some high schoolers doing some job shadowing today. So they're all juniors, so they're gonna help us feed the zoo. Obviously we're starting with butterscotch, so it's a little scary. It's okay. Oh, this one's gonna be good. Oh, over here. Don't pay attention to them. The water's in here. What's up with him lately? I mean, she struck. Good job, Mike. <laughs> Sorry, with butterscotch. Let's see who else is eating today. Oh! <laughs> good job. She didn't even strike, really. Yeah, you only got your fingers bit. You want to feed the sunrise? Man, I don't really want to. No, Jay, open it for real. <laughs> I can't, I'm so Open scary. it for real, come on. They're laughing at you back there. I don't care, they can laugh. I know you can't hear me, but there's food. Snakes don't snakes have external don't have ears. ears. So basically how a snake hears is almost Mike, like- Mike, we don't have time for a lesson right now. Can you please, Mike? Take it to her face. Why would you do that? Okay. No, don't do that. Oh, oh, go, 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 go. Yeah, but I don't have a good spot. You do. Just put the face to the face. She's gonna strike. Connie, Jay, can you tell me what to do? Yeah, just put it to her face. <laughs> Jay, look at her. I can't do it. She's so cute. You're in a good position where she can strike sideways and not straight out at your face. So what was it about the ears? So snakes don't have ears, external ears, so they actually like really only hear like in vibrations. But, what were we talking about? Why were we even talking about it? Hey guys, it's stuff like this. This is really like our first year that we're getting into all this new stuff. I'm loving the fact that we have people coming in for job shadows. Listen, don't get me wrong. Me and Mike are young, but these kids are like the actual future. This whole place is one day gonna be ran by them. Me and Mike are gonna be old in like a senior living home or something. Maybe even together, you know. <laughs> Got me. But you guys get what I'm saying. Are you shrieking from the basement? And I was like, oh my gosh, is oh, there something I was just out? <laughs> trying to feed sunrise. Totally normal. Yeah. Totally yeah. normal. God. Oh my god, that I literally pretty sure I felt his tooth on my nail. Cool, cool. All right, Honestly, all right. they might be running this place a lot faster than we thought. You guys ready or yeah. yeah. Uh, the animals. What is the occasion? What's the special occasion that you put you, a hat on her? You did it. You did it. It's Connie's birthday. <gasps> Is it? Happy no. birthday to... Uh, Is it on right now? It's like... We have became electricians. Yeah. yeah. And we're trying to figure out how this fan is wired in here and if Your it's shoes. working. These are the Nike Unos. Oh, they got Velcro. Yeah. You can feel like a child. I like that. shoes, guys. Mm. Can I get a... <laughs> What are you doing? It's a special occasion. What is the occasion? You won't tell me. What is it? Jay, what I, are you doing? I don't even, I honestly don't know. I just want to go eat Miguel. Obviously guys, we just started here at the Reptarium, but we want to continue this into Legacy. You know, Addison here, she's actually was with Lee the first hour doing marine stuff. So she was helping with the tank, helping with the fish spot. And obviously across, we'll have everything from the mammals to the fish, the reptiles and people. Lots of people, we need more people. Caitlin, got it. I'm Jay, this is Mike, Jeffrey. So, what we're gonna have you do is hold the rabbit. Uh, I would maybe flip your hand around the other way. And now what you want to aim for is nose to nose. Bam. There you go. Oh, good job. No, that was good. How was that? How that felt? <laughs> Exhilarating, right? Yeah. Who's I'm next? Not, she's not in the tree. It's You'll do okay. it? Yeah. She's All not right. Yet. To that side because okay. she's on the ground. They must not have seen the videos of what Perdita does sometimes. Right there. Oh, that's perfect. Good, Good job. Good. Dang! These kids are professionals. They really might actually be running the place faster than me and Mike anticipated. By lunch? Face to face. <laughs> okay! Thank you. All right, Sunfire. I'm gonna open it for you. Missing mic, great. And then I'm gonna stand right behind the door. Sunfire. <laughs> behind the door is the danger door. Get her out, Mike. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, yes. Why couldn't I have had Sunfire? 
Huh? Guys, remember, when you're feeding your snake, I'm not saying I'm no professional, but I am saying I've fed a lot of snakes. One of the most important rules, nose and nose. It matters, guys, it matters. So if they don't catch it nose to nose, what they're gonna do is they're actually gonna just let it go until they find the note. You think that lucky nose, there's a nose on his oh look at him there okay listen i said i wasn't a professional and sometimes snakes do weird stuff he'll get that in a little bit so you're gonna take the tongs have you ever fed anything Hello. you remember what the most important rules is huh no. nose to nose she knows this is a nose, <laughs> nose joke boom look at that perfect <laughs> you're close <laughs> not all snakes eat mice and rats some snakes like to eat other snakes like a king snake we're gonna give her a so what I'm trying to say is smelt, guinea pigs, snakes, geckos, guinea pigs, smelt, smelt. Oh, see? Patience. We got something to feed. Size appropriate feeding. We're not gonna be given lemon drop a guinea pig. Sometimes a snake might seem super, super, super interested. Sometimes they just don't want to take off a tong. So what we'll do is we'll lay it in there. They'll come and find it later. Ooh, good job. Ice Cube. Ice Cube. This is my dog. I love that snake. It's my dog. Now, speaking of, is a beginner snake video, Mike, you forgot the most important thing. You guys know about Austin yet? This is Austin Powers. Mole Whoa, snake. snake. Mole, mole, mole. I thought we were going to do it more intense. I think he came from Dingo. Daddy oh, Dingo Dinkleman. He left me a voice message the other day. He said, Tingle, you biscuit. And I love it. Taking a quick break from feeding with the crew. Come over here to the Legacy and see if there's anything going on today. Uh, I know Alex is out of town. Well, it's dark in here. Did they turn off the power? Oh, I wonder what's going on. It really is dark and throughout this whole place. I mean, I see some lights on. You can see the exit sign right up here. I actually didn't even notice we had exit signs. This looks pretty cool. What up, guys? Uh, I don't know if you guys know this or not, the power's out. Yes, I am well aware What's of going on? I already swapped over power. What does that mean? No longer going to be this temp panel, it's going to be the permanent power to the building. No way! That's a huge step, huh? Yes, sir. So how long will this process take you? Is this done by the end of the day, end of the week, or end of the month? As long as everything goes smoothly, the end of this next half an hour. I know it's a little dangerous in here because it's dark, but come on, look at how cool these tanks look in the dark. Wow, I absolutely love it. We got a little light here so I can say that like, remember, you know, this side is gonna be a lot darker. Mostly the water and lights from inside the tank are going to light our ways. In some ways, this is how it's going to look in here. Even just the light coming through and the color on the wall, wow. I, I wish Brian would have had a chance to do this. I know he would have been so psyched to just see it even with the lights off and stuff. So I'm just gonna sit here for a little bit and soak it in because it's, uh, uh, it's really cool. You have to know your snake. Bugatti is a snake that we know he goes up and up and up and up. You know, kind of like that Cardi B song. So, so basically, know them, know their behaviors, know what they're gonna do. Yeah, and he's probably gonna drop his rat three times before he actually eats it. That's just what he does. That's what he does? Time. Yep. Every time we feed him, he drops it. And then he swallows it. Over. Okay. Wow, look at Neo. We have Tiger Lily, we have Neo, we have... Okay. Just like with all the other ones, she's going to kind of like fall down. <laughs> and then you're literally just going to touch that to her face. There we go. You did great. That was the snake's fault. Nose to nose, watch the magic show. Dun 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 dun. His name's Ben. Oh, there you go. Now it will be gone in 42 seconds. These kind of snakes actually will often eat their prey while it's still alive. They aren't constrictors, so they don't constrict around the snake. As you see, he literally wasted no time. He's already to the shoulder. He's gonna get that thing down in no time. Also, another cool thing about these snakes is they also are another snake that will eat other snakes, and that is phenomenal to it. <laughs> that was great teamwork. If you're gonna feed with your hand, know the snake. Safety. Yeah, Mike, a whole lot of oomph. I thought the fourth rule was know your snakes. Is that fourth? Ivy's actually starting to go into shed too, and so she's not actually gonna be eating today. We are gonna feed Ariana something a little bit special. She's still peeing and pooping from the last meal, so we're gonna give her this week off. Hopefully she'll break out of shed, and then we'll feed her, and we might have somebody special feed her. No? Lori. Oh. Yeah, somebody special feed her. Another first today that we're actually trying out, guys, is I'm sorry to all you people that love these rodents, but some guinea pigs. And again, I'm sorry if it, you don't like it. This is their first time eating guinea pigs. So we're going to try a few different snakes that would absolutely crush them. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this, but 
Oh, yeah, without a doubt. And remember guys, I mean, rabbits are cute. Mice and rats are cute. I love mice and rats. I know it's something different that we don't normally do, but you don't want to be hypocritical. If we could feed rabbits and rodents and mice and rats and all that stuff, then guinea pigs are right up there too. Uh, we got this from a source that breeds them for feeding snakes specifically, so it's not like it was like a pet shop or something like that. But we got a couple more to feed. At least the first one went great. Guinea pigs are very high in fat. So this is more of a treat. Oh, wow, dude, she just hit that so freaking hard. That's crazy. Tongs. Treats for snakes, but also guinea pigs are a nice in-between size. A jumbo jumbo rat is really big, but like it's not as girthy as a guinea pig, but it's not quite as big as a pig, a rabbit. So again, it's that in-between size. Hi, Fury. He's biting the tongs. Uh, wrong spot there, Night Fury. Biting the tongs and he's wrapping the tongs. Well, this is the first. Um, I don't know. Watch if he lets go. Yeah. Oh, don't worry, dude. I'm gonna just set everything in here, and I know he's not gonna eat the tongs. Maybe. So we're just gonna see if he'll let go because what he's doing is he's actually pinching the tongs shut. So even if I wanted to let go of the guinea pig, I couldn't. Maybe these tongs were a bad idea. I mean, that could be your hand right now. You know, you're very right. The meal is with Night Fury in his house. And obviously he's been decorating the glass because this looks terrible. What is that? So I think we're going to leave Night Fury alone. We have one more snake to be the guinea pig too. And yeah, uh, marshmallow. Oh, hello. So I was curious to see if he'd eat a guinea pig. And sure enough, without a doubt in my mind. What did we learn here? Guinea pigs, treats, not everyday meals. Guys, it's been so long since we've seen Jay and Vlad together. So this right here is Vlad, and in case you didn't know, this is my arch. Ah! And this is our legless lizard, who is getting a lot friendlier, I might say, thanks to Connie. He's getting get friendlier doesn't mean that I'm getting braver. I'm not gonna pick him up, but I do have his tail, which, ah! Pretty good for me, comparatively you know speaking, one? from where I came from. I'll pick him up. Ah, party. nah, okay. You are not scared of him like that, are you? You didn't get it. This is exposure therapy. <laughs> and that was enough redemption for me. <laughs> I'm in love with the shape of you. Yeah, because they're not We're gonna do salad prep. Um, so they're going to be our little chef boy artist. And fix up salads for the whole lizard fam. Sick, okay. We're gonna get a little lesson in, in uh, iguana nutrition. And actually I need a garbage. And this stuff is so cool to me. I mean, Brian would love this. This is the direction that we've wanted to go. Not only educating and entertaining people, but teaching the next generation how to educate and entertain people and take care of these wonderful animals. Uh, I get very inspired seeing this stuff and seeing these younger kids come out here and help us out. I hope it's something that not only we carry into Legacy, which I know we will, but something that drives the wheels further and we think of new ways to do this same type of thing. I know that's what Brian would want. I just want to check on Drogo. How you been, Drogs? Oh, look at your nose. Oh, sorry. I was gonna try to, yeah. Dude, I'm thinking she's looking huge. Is this her up in the top? I think so. Look how spread her scales are, dude. You think she's got eggs in her? We got all three. God, I love this cage so much. I do too. It's literally my favorite cage. And listen, don't get me wrong. I love the black headed, but I think we could do somebody crazy. Like, imagine if we could get a large amount of some kind of lizard. Right? Honestly, those blue collared lizards would be yeah, sick to do like bunch, 40. Like 12, mm -hmm. 12, 30. 12, 30. Bunch out. Nose to nose. Watch your toes. Oh. All right, guys, what are the rules? Tell me one rule. Nose to nose. No, you're a snake. Hey, stay safe. Stay safe. Let's go. You want to get the tongs back from Night Fury? Uh, not really. Are you sure? Is that a joke? How did you manage that now? He ate huh? the tongs. Oh my god. Oh, no kidding. Does it look like a joke now? Oh my god, I never know with you. Oh, look, he's letting go. He let go. He knew. All right, knew. good. Don't stick your hand in there. Yeah, I wasn't going to. I have to. <laughs> this is how Misty Mike works. No, stop. You got to be quiet. You gotta be quick with the knife here. I think he bit it just because he was hungry, but he doesn't know what it is. So I'm gonna leave this in here. If he comes to eat it, fantastic. If not, oh well. <laughs> feed it to something else. Listen, let me tell you guys something. I love that you guys are crushing it with the feast and the feedings, but some of you guys' names, <laughs> if you want to put in like a little pronunciation. Oh, like a in, phonetic thing? Yes, phonetic spelling. in quotations. We love it and excuse our mispronunciation. <laughs> but Ethan. Feel. Feel with a TH or an F? TH. Ethan Feel, thank you so much. We appreciate you. And salt and pepper, they're about to love this. Have some fun, because we love it. Salty, this is from Ethan. 
Yeah! Hey. What a throw! Ready? Ethan got you another one. What? He said Ethan got her another one. She didn't care. Okay, here you go, Melissa. It's your turn. Ethan, Ethan, big girl. I'm still working on training. Oh! Oh! A little pop up. Time for Trevor. I use something. Oh! Oh my gosh, she's crazy. This thing's an animal. Mike, move so I can get some leverage. What are you doing? No, stop! What are you doing? Oh my god! I panic. I see. Jeez. How many do you have left? One. So she just ate two. Melissa, in honor of Ethan. Never put up. Here you go. You got it. You can't be scared. One of us has to be strong in this relationship. Sure ain't me. All right, what do I do? Okay, Mike, move your big I'm old trying self. to get her up here. Big girl. Pepper, big girl. In the mouth, Melissa. Oh! Thank you, Ethan. Hey, Thanks, Ethan. They appreciate you too. We're still working on the training. Salty, <laughs> stay. I love you so much. Always, always a great, Always a great time getting salt out. Speaking of out. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, there's a playlist that you can watch all kinds of videos. You can also hit that subscription button. It would mean a lot to me. Also, hit that like button while you're down there. Have a wonderful day, Reptile Army. Remember, snakes don't have snakes external don't have ears. ears. And I promise, I'll see you in the next 